right now in the track and field space there are so many persons who are worried and concerned about Sheldon Fraser Price and what she's going to do for this year at the Olympics and there are some who are even arguing that she's not going to make it to the 100 meter finals this year they are saying that she will not be able to medal because the competition is too strong for her right now because she's old that's usually the argument that they pose when they are downplaying Shelly and Fraser Price's ability to perform and to do well so they are saying that she's old and the younger athletes who are out there now they are going to take over for example Julian Alfred, Shakir Richardson, Sherika Jackson and even Elaine Thompson here of Jamaica is considered to be in a better place than Shelly and Fraser Price to medal by some of the fans out there of course now as for me I think Sheldon Fraser Price is going to medal at this year's Olympics and it will possibly be a gold medal that she will be carrying home. Now Sheldon Fraser Price is one of the most fearless and formidable sprinters out there. She's doing it for more than a decade and she's been doing well. The thing with Sheldon Fraser Price is that whenever she gets defeat, she usually comes back better than before. Last year at the World Championship she did not get to perform to her best ability because she was injured. So some persons are using that as a thing to say that, well, it's just telling that she's done and she doesn't have much more to offer to the sport. But I see her as a big threat for the crown this year. Elaine Thompson, Sherika Jackson, Shakir Richardson, Julian Alfred, they'll have to come with their A games to keep Shellyan out of the medal and possibly away from the Olympic crown. It's her last Olympic year and I know that she wants to take it home with a bang. She'd want to close the chapter just as how she opened it. Remember in 2008 when she burst onto the scene, she demolished that 100 meter final in the 2008 Olympic. Now that she's coming to the end, I think that's still fresh in her mind and she wants to close just as how she opened. And what better way to close than walking away with a medal and more so the 100 meter gold medal. That would be special so for those who are writing her up and think that it's over for her let's remember that it was not so long ago back in 2022 when she ran the fastest season opener that has ever been done in track and field history so i want you guys to understand that she still has the ability and the potential the only thing i see standing in shell and first the price is way this year from doing extremely well is her health and injury problems if anything goes down that line then there's a possibility that she could be out of contention but as of now i see shellen fraser price making it to the number one spot on the podium as a matter of fact i think that she's the biggest threat right now to that sprinting show so let us not write her off let us remember that whenever she goes down she's going to come back fighting harder than before